Hi dragons, this is Miss Fisher and I'm filming this for you today from our beautiful library at Sadler Means YWLA. I can't wait until all of us can be together in this awesome space again. Um, and today is also Monday and it is drop everything and read day in your house advisory meetings. So I thought this would be a great time for me to let you know that even though we can't all be in this great library together right now, you do actually have a pretty awesome library available to you all the time through your Chromebook or your phone. So if you look at your portal on your Chromebook, you should find a tile for Mac and Bia. You might have to search for it in the search bar. Um, but once you find it and click on it, it should log you in automatically, and then you'll have access to all of our ebooks in our online library. You can also download the app. Um, that's what I have on my phone right now, and so you can read on your phone. And once you've downloaded a book, you don't even need uh, like Wi-Fi to be able to read it. It will just be there available for you all the time. Don't worry if you don't know how to log in to Mac and Via or find it. I'm sending out information to your house advisory teachers so they can all definitely help you log in and then for sure your ELA teachers will know. So we'll make sure that you get to Mac and Via. Today I want to recommend uh, a book that I think you'll really enjoy. It's one of my favorites from a series that I really, really love. And I found it not only on Mac and Via, but I also found it a paper copy in our library. So um, the book I want to recommend is one of the Enola Holmes mystery books and it's called The Case of the Cryptic Crinoline. So Enola Holmes is a really rad character. Uh, there are several books about her. I'm a fan of all of them. This is a particular favorite um, and you can kind of read them in any order. It won't matter. They don't all build on each other. It's not like that. Um, but her name probably sounds familiar, and that's because she has a super famous older brother, a guy named Sherlock, and she's a lot like her brother in that she is very smart, and she keeps finding herself in the middle of these crazy mysteries that she's super good at solving. Um, in this particular book, Enola is all by herself. Uh, she's actually kind of on the run from her brothers, so uh, but you got to read it to find out why. And she's become very close to her landlady, a woman named Miss Tupper. And she comes home one day to discover that Miss Tupper is gone. So the mystery becomes, has Miss Tupper left on her own? Has she been kidnapped? Has something happened to her? Is Miss Tupper maybe not who she appears to be? Enola Holmes is on the case. And there's actually a famous historical character, Florence Nightingale, who shows up in the story as well, but I'm not going to tell you how or why, because you should read it on your own. Another great reason to get into this series right now is because Netflix is about to drop a movie about Enola Holmes, and the actress who plays Eleven in Stranger Things is playing Enola. So it looks really great. I'm also going to share the trailer for that with your house advisory teachers uh, so they can hopefully get that out to you because it looks like a great movie, and you should get in on the secret before everyone else does and read an Enola Holmes book. So Case of the Cryptic Krillin is available for you in Mac and Via. A thing to know about Mac and Via before you start looking around um, is that it works just like a real library. There are only so many copies of the book available, even though it's an ebook. So if someone else checks it out before you do, you can actually mark it as a favorite, and then that'll help you make sure that when it's available again, you know, and you can grab it so you can be the next one to read it. So, Enola Holmes and the Case of the Cryptic Crinoline is my pick for today's Mac and Via Monday. I'm going to come back every Monday during your drop everything and read time and recommend another book from our Mac and Via library that I think you'll really enjoy. So thanks so much for watching this and happy reading dragons.